Hello everybody, Wee Woo, how are we all? Hope we're doing fantastically today. We are playing Resident Evil on the PlayStation. My face is really bright. I'm gonna see if I can change that. How are we all doing though? What happened to him? <laughs> Greetings. Yeah. Yeah, I realized, Kel. Why is chat Nemo? Oh, fudge. Thank you very much, Kelp. Appreciate that. Um, <laughs> so it was an emo only because I've seen things going around of people like hate rating offline channels and then proceeding to report the streamer for uh, the chat. And I'm like, I don't want to risk that, even though I'm not being hate rated. So I'm just going to, you know, shove it in emo only real quick. <laughs> so thanks for letting me know. Completely uh, forgot I did that. Um, yeah, it's messed up. But anyway, how are you all doing? I hope you're all doing well. Kelp, thank you for letting me know, because otherwise, uh, that would have been a yikes. And I need to remember that I'm doing that now. Loading content. Please don't turn off my PS4! Yeah. Yeah, my, my PS4. That's what this is. Olive, hello, wee wee, how are you? Hope you're doing well. Welcome, welcome, how are things? I love how it's like, do you want to create save data? If you don't, you can't play the game! You think it's a console behind. Just a little bit, just a little bit. Just a teeny, teeny bit. Options, display, oh yeah, we're going for all the settings. Wide and original? No, no, we're wide, we're wide. Um, okay. <laughs> Brightness. Adjust via TV monitor or adjust via game? Literally cannot even tell the difference. Like. Oh, oh, I see a difference. I see a difference. Okay, we're gonna go for a little bit, a little bit. You can. Apparently I'm just freaking blind. <laughs> Language, mm hmm subtitles are on. Good, good, good. Uh, okay. Please don't turn off the PlayStation R for system. I am excited. I promised, I don't know if Caleb is here, Gaming Caleb. I promised Caleb that I would play this game ages ago and just never got around to it, so here I am playing it now for realsies. So, Caleb, this one's for you. You're missing out, but it's for you anyway. <laughs> I've never played a Resident Evil game except for 2 and 7. 7 is completely different to the rest of the Resident Evil games, so I've only ever played 2. Resident Evil. Judge Judy! I love it. Thank you so much for the follow, I appreciate it. I hope you're having a great time. Alternate or original? Well, I don't know the difference. Let's go with alternate. There's a reason they made an alternate scheme, right? You have good eyes, I say wearing glasses. You didn't say that, you just said you can. How do you like your games? Like climbing a mountain, fulfilling but takes a lot of work. Like going on a hike, good exercise but not too strenuous. And like taking a walk, you can relax and enjoy yourself. <laughs> this is like the most interesting difficulty selection I've ever seen. Uh, I am going to say taking a walk, which I'm hoping is easy and they're not just going to pull a fast one on me. Because I can't aim with these. I'm not good with controllers. I'm a PC player, but the games were cheaper on PlayStation. And I like not spending as much money as possible. <laughs> we're taking a walk, guys. Let's have a little walk. Character select. Chris Redfield or Jill Valentine? <gasps> oh, I can choose the new and improved high quality versions or the trashy low quality versions. Oh, I don't know what to pick. Part of me says pick the original detail. Ex experience the game for what it was when it came out. But the other part of me is like, I have no emotional connection. So why not just go high quality? <laughs> like, why not pick the best resolution for the characters, you know? Fudge, you know, I'm going to Google to see if it makes a difference. Hope, like, maybe it doesn't. Maybe it doesn't make a difference. But you never know. Uh... 
apparently, uh, apparently Jill is the easy mode. Sorry, Chris. <laughs> You're being ditched. Um, the question is, do I want to go? Hmm. Let's go old school. Let's go old school. Why not? You know? Why not go old school? Old school graphics. We don't need none of this new remastered fancy nonsense, you know? Uh, unless the rest of the game's textures look like really great and then my character looks trash. I didn't consider that. Alpha team is flying around the forest zone, situated in northwest Raccoon City. Where Raccoon we are searching City. for the helicopter of our compatriots, Bravo team, who disappeared during the middle of their mission. We have enough for Bravo team. Bizarre murder cases have recently occurred in Raccoon City. There are outlandish reports of families being attacked by a group of about ten people. Victims were apparently eaten. Oh, that's lovely. The Bravo Cannibalism. team was sent in to investigate, but we lost contact. Look, Chris. Bravo team's helicopter was a derelict. Save for the remaining body of Kevin. Kevin, no! Kevin, no! Not we Kevin. We continued our search for the other members, and it turned into a nightmare. What's happening? Oh, that's Jill. I think. I think that's Jill. That's Jill, right? That's gotta be Jill. Dying in three, two, one, zero. Dang! I was off by like five seconds. That's the fifth second. I was totally counting. He's also not dead yet, so that's unfortunate. That is violent. Yeah, I too would f freak out at the zombie dogs just tearing someone to pieces. Hey, Jill, you might want to, like, skedaddle. Okay, falling to the ground's not how you do it. Come on! They be running, though. Hey, Brad! Brad! Brad, what are you doing, Brad? We're gonna die, Brad! Classic slow motion. Chris, this way. Who the fuck are you? You look important and popular. Damn it. Make for that mansion. Oh yes, of course. Go for the mansion. What could possibly go wrong, right? What could possibly go wrong if you just run run into the mansion? Enter the survival horror. There are only three stars members left now. Captain Wesker, Unfortunate. Barry, and myself. We don't know where Chris is. Well, no, Chris is missing. But weren't we running for the mansion together? What is this place? Not quite your ordinary house, that's for sure. Hey, Whisker, where's Chris? Jill, no. No! I'm gonna go back out there. Okay, we Whisker. Find... What was that? It was a gun, you idiot. Chris? No. Jill, go and investigate. Do I'm I want to? Him. Chris and I go back a long way. All right. You two go. I'll secure this area. Stay sharp. Can I stay blunt? It 
it's a door. It's an open door. <clears throat> A dining room. Congratulations, that is indeed what this room is. Oh, I can move and control things now. An ink ribbon. Sure. Oh god, I don't even know the control scheme. Okay. Um. Uh. Okay. The, the fudge. I don't know what I'm doing. Maybe I need to look at the controls. Okay. Aim. Move. Uh-huh. Okay. Okay. What's the difference between the original? Uh-oh. Okay, whatever. Move. 180 degree turn. Run. Examine. Status. Reload. While aiming. Oh, left and down is 100. Oh, God. Run. Ex oh, my lord. Map and attack... Okay. So this is the map. Well, this game is actually super... I mean, I know it's old, but like... I would have assumed that the only movement is the silent flick of the candle's flame. Wow, this is an old game. I would have assumed the remake would like... change it a little bit. You can save your progress. Use the ink ribbon. <gasps> Wait! Oh my god, you can only save by using an ink ribbon? Oh, I am so fudging screwed. I'm so screwed. I have limited saves? Oh man, I love this. I am going to screw this up. <laughs> no one told me I had a limited amount of saves. Yeah. It's not even like one ink ribbon for one typewriter. It's like you straight up use it when you're not like... When the two have run each other through, the path to your destiny will open. What does that even mean? I think you'd better take a look at this. What is it? Blood. Blood. Thank you. Jill, see if you can find any other clues. I'll be examining this. I don't know how much more examination you can get from just one pool of blood. Like, you've seen it. There's blood there. What are you going to do? A DNA test? In the middle of nowhere? Yeah, not likely. Resident Evil installed? Yeah, I'd hope so! Well, I take the emblem. Sure. From the status screen, select an item, select examine. The details of the item will be explained. Okay. Examine. Emblem. It's gold around the other edges, either frequent fitting. There's nothing unusual. Okay. So, sh sure. Berry. Berry. Are we just gonna look at him? We're just looking at him. Noted. Noted. A large filth encrusted jar. The only movement is a sign flick of the candle's flame. Okay, that's the same thing. Well. I guess we just like continue into the next room? Question mark? Oh boy. Oh, the camera. Oh boy, the camera. It's locked from the other side. It's also locked. An emblem of armor is carved into the lock. Can I use this? It's not necessary to use this now. That would be a no. Camera angles, man. There's an elevator here. It doesn't look like you can access it from this floor. I am not a fan of going down there. So let's just, uh, you know, 
chill out and just maybe go around the corner here instead. This looks like a really nice corner. This is not a really nice corner. This is a bad corner. No one wants to be in this corner. This is a horrible corner. Chris? Oh, what the fudge, what the fudge, what the fudge. How do I aim? What the fudge? My gun does nothing! There's no aiming in this game. I got him! He's down, boys! Oh, he's not staying down! The corpse of your comrade, Kenneth! No! He's holding something. It's a film that belonged to him. I need a video player to see what's recorded on it. His throat's been torn out. Yeah, lovely. Better report back to Wesker that there's a zombie in my way! Oh. Oh, now he is dead. First kill's a special. Yeah! Special! Wesker, that was a zombie and it attacked me and it was scary. It was a scary zombie. What is it? Look out! It's a monster! I thought I killed it! Let me take care of it! You're doing a great job, Barry. What the hell is this thing? Zombie. I found Kenneth killed by this thing. Let's report this to Wesker. Uh, that thing's gonna get back up. I, I, don't, I, don't, I don't like this one bit. Not one. It got back up. The zombies don't stay dead. Wesker's gone? Lovely. We love that. Jill, help me look for him. Let's not leave this hall. Good idea. Look for him, but don't leave the hall. A Chinese urn. Better finish searching the hall first. Yep, yeah, mm-hmm. Another Chinese urn. Is there a way to make the text go by faster? Like, is that an option I can, uh, I can pick somewhere? Wait, that's display for aspect ratio. Do I not get any other options? No. Controls? I guess not. I guess I just gotta hold down the, the thing. Okay, so we actually need to search this entire area. Maybe he down there. Maybe he down here. Okay, he's not down there. <laughs> he's not down there. Any luck, Jill? No, nothing. What's going on around here? I can't figure it out. Same here. Chris, there's I'm zombies. Whisker. There's not much we can do. We can search for him separately. I'll investigate the dining room again. Okay, then I'll try the door on the other side. Dude, there's a monster in the dining room. <sighs> You're gonna be dead. Gigantic. We could easily get lost. Let's start from the first floor. Okay. Oh, I almost forgot. It's a lockpick. You'd make. Thanks, man. I got the lock Thanks. pick. I may need it. Listen, if something happens, let's meet up in this hall. Got it? Got okay. it. It's gonna go poorly. So do I only get the one lock? Oh, the lock pick I can. A tool for unlocking most simple locks. So it doesn't seem like this gets used up. I can hope. I can really hope. does get used up I'm sort of a little screwed hello what are you woman drawing water <laughs> okay 
It almost seems like it's watching me. Everything's watching me. Looks like they could come to life at any moment. It literally just woman drawing water. Okay. Wait, no, I didn't want to... Wait, is there something... <gasps> oh, I'm about to be a big brain right now. I think... You see that glistening? You see that glistening up there? I think I gotta pull this. How do I... How do I pull it? I think I need to get to the other side of that room to push it, maybe? I wonder if I can... Yeah, 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 yeah. And then, and then, and then... Oh, I don't like this. Oh, this is scary. Oh, this is scary! <laughs> yes, there we go. That's what I wanted to do. Oh, yeah, look at that. Skill. And now, I hop on top, and then I grab this. There's a map of the mansion! Yeah, I'm taking it! Oh boy. Fudge, this place is huge. Okay. Noted, noted. I got the map of the mansion. Okay, I guess we're gonna have a look down this creepy hallway. What could go wrong, right? Oh, there's just various art supplies? Is that a knife? Will I take the dagger? Yeah. Yeah, I'll take the dagger. Using defensive items such as daggers will allow you to escape momentarily and go by an enemy. You will not be able to escape when the enemy grabs you from behind. To equip a defensive item, go to the status screen and select an item from the defensive item menu and select the equip command. If it's set to manual, you must press it to use the defensive item. Right, okay, if that's the case... I think I might actually equip it. Uh, I, I might swap to manual, sorry. God, I pressed the wrong button. Let's let's swap to manual items. And that way I can use the LT button. Uh, whenever I want to. What could go wrong? Everything. <laughs> Gonna be a quick death. Alexa, hello, Wee Wee, how are you? Hope you're doing well. Welcome, welcome. Yeah, so about that what could go wrong part. Shoot your weapon, Jill! Woo! Oh, 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 I'm leaving! Oh, I'm leaving! It's locked. An emblem of a sword is carved into the lock. What fudging emblem is this? Not a sword. See, so you told you that you did. How are you doing though, Alexa? I hope you're doing well. Oh my god, this camera. Quick, quick, I have a smart, I have a smart plan. Smart plan. I'll never need to go into the room again. I'm gonna block him off. I'm gonna block the zombie. The zombie cannot get me now. <laughs> what are you gonna do, dummy? You okay, but you have to go to work soon? Rip, Alexa. I hope you have a good day at work. See, look at him. He can't touch me. You staying while you can? Sure thing. I appreciate that. L okay, so that zombie's never gonna touch me ever again. See, smart moves. Smart plays by me, the genius. And now 10. Skilled. <laughs> um... Anyway, what's in here? It's locked. An emblem of a helmet is carved into the lock. So I can't use my lockpick, can I? It's not necessary to use this now. Okay. Let's check up on our buddy old friend who's totally been killed by the zombie. I'm calling it. He is dead. He's dead. The zombie's got him. He's gone. He's not... Oh, zombie is gone. But where did it go? Um. 
Okay, well, in that case, I'm guessing there's nothing important in this room. L yet. Yet. So I'm gonna check out the, 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 the... Wait, actually, hold on. I actually don't think there's anywhere else I can go. Shoot, maybe there is. Oh, did I just block the area I'm actually meant to go to? I don't know. Let's go down here. Let's just let's just hang out down here. You know, let's let's see what is in here. You know, I'm cool not knowing what's on the other side of the door. I'm okay with never knowing. That's fine. I don't need to know. Oh, this is a door. I thought it was a painting. Ooh, I don't like that. Ooh, boy. Okay. There's some graves here. That's always lovely. There's a freaking graveyard. There's no name or inscription. Locks on the other side. Can I use my lockpick? No. Do you have a door where you need, like, emblem? I don't think lockpicking will- Yeah, no, I didn't think so. Yeah, no, no, I thought as much. I just thought it was worth a try, you know? You never- you never know. You never know. What I do know is I don't- Oh, I don't like this. Oh, I don't like this. A tomb engraved with the picture of an angel. There's an indentation in the shape of an arrowhead. Okay. I forgot how puzzly Resident Evil games were. What's over this way? Is that an ammo box? Will you take the shotgun shells? Sure, I don't have a shotgun, but I will take the shells. And I'm guessing that's everything back here that I can do so far. And that was, yep, that was that dead end place. Vic, hello, wee wee, how are you? Hope you're doing well. If you aren't scared by horror, it's just a puzzle game. Exactly, exactly. It's just a puzzle game. It's, I'm not scared by horror, me. Scared by <laughs> What a joke. How you doing, Vic? I hope you're doing well. I'm doing all right. I was thinking of not streaming today because I wasn't really feeling the best, and then I thought, fudge it, I want to play Resident Evil. <laughs> the first ones were the best. I have heard good things about the series in general, and I've just never played them except for number one, except for number number two and number seven. And I know seven is completely different to the rest of them. So I've only played the second one, really. Except the second one was very different because it didn't have this whole uh, room thing. It had you, the remake. I played the remake. That's what I'm trying to say. Blend is still vividly depicted. Locked from the other side. Here we go. We're getting somewhere. Just no, like, one fact about the original game. Valid. Valid. I don't have a map of the second floor. So I'm going in blind. Is that a gem she's holding? Oh! <gasps> The series won't die yet. What's it up to? Eight now, right? Oh, shoot. I can push this? Oh, the zombie's alive. No, no, stop pushing. Stop pushing. Stop pushing. The zombie's alive. Oh, hey! Headshot, lol. Uh, it's unfortunate I only have four bullets left, so I sort of need some. Crush the zombie with the statue! What I'm actually thinking is I'm thinking if there's, like, a ledge I can push the statue off of? Cause like that there looks like a ledge, right? I'm gonna push the zomb the zombie, the statue off the ledge. Yeah. I'm smart. Also watch movies and you really like the series. There wasn't evil movies. Then glass window. The pattern sense of resembles a woman. I didn't know there were movies. It's locked. An emblem of a sword. It's 
It's locked on the other side. Oh, there's another dagger. I'll take it. It's like you with Assassin's Creed, what, that you've never... Uh, you mean like you've never watched them? Or played them, I mean? You've just watched? I... See, it's funny. Resident Evil's not one of those game series that, like, really makes me want to play it. Like, there's nothing, like, particularly captivating or interesting about it necessarily. Except for the fact that I know it's, like, one of the greatest, like, game series and a lot of people love it. And I've played 2 and I enjoyed it, and i played 7 and I enjoyed it, so I'm like, you know what, may as well. Have the books. There are books as well. God, the series has everything. On Netflix came out an animated movie with Resident Evil. Nice. I didn't know that. I didn't know that. Here we go. We get this gem thing. Will I take the blue gemstone? Yeah, the question is... What it do, though? What it do, though? It's beautifully cut and polished. What does it do? Who knows? Equip. Right. So, essentially, I have two weapons. My gun and my knife. Riddle probably- yeah, it's probably used for, like, something. Oh, nice, Vic. I've also never played a Lara Croft game. So... Whoops. Played some, but not everyone, yeah. I have not played any Lara Croft games. Not a single Tomb Raider. Just haven't. Not because I haven't wanted to, or because, like, I think it's bad. I've just never played them. Oh, that's the sword em Is that the sword emblem? I don't know. Maybe it is, maybe it isn't. We shall see. Show the Tomb Raider. I do have that. I do have that. I also have Rise of the Tomb Raider. I did not mean to select that again. No, no, I'm playing Shadow of the Tomb Raider. Come on. The emblem of armor. Now, this shouldn't work. It's not necessary to use now. Okay. God dang it. Freaking cameras, man. More of Uncharted than Tomb Raider. Yeah, same. I've played Uncharted 1, 2, and 3, and I love them. It's locked. An emblem of a sword. Okay, let's try the emblem here now. It's not necessary. Well, fudge everything. <laughs> I have a gem, and it's like... I, I'm, I know I definitely use it for something. You never played Uncharted? Uncharted is fantastic. I'm considering playing it on stream one of these days. Though, let's be honest, there are a lot of games I want to play on stream. There you go, that's Kenneth's Corpse. Unfortunate, unfortunate. This door was not open before. Can I show you the emblem? Uh, I can. It doesn't look like it has a sword or a shield on it. Like, I don't even know what it does look like. It's- I mean, it is a shield, but it's not working. <laughs> so it's probably something else, I want to guess. Oh, I don't like this. <gasps> Ammo! Yes, I will take the magazine. Oh, it just swaps it out. Okay, it swaps out my current mag for... Right, okay. Yeah, something like that. A large bird cage. There's a dead raven. No, the raven. Oh. There's a corpse collapsed on the floor like it was an instant death. What the hell happened in this mansion? That is a good freaking question. Will I take the green herb? Yes. You can't carry any more items. Of course I can't. Um, which is probably really... Bad. Com combined. Dang it. <laughs> uh, my inventory seems to be a little full. A herb that grows wild in this region. That is unfortunate. Hopefully I don't need it. Oh my god, camera! Even the body's laying cut a little with a knife. Wait, what? God. 
You mean like this? Wait, no. How do you... You, you mean... I, I'm trying. <laughs> oh, wait, we can aim downwards. Okay, okay, I can aim down. I can aim down. Uh... Yeah, I th honestly, I think we're good. I don't, th I don't think this boy getting back up, you know? I don't think he getting back up. <laughs> he doesn't have a head. Oh, it looked like he sort of did. Oh, well. Whoops. Yeah, some of these zombies, it's hard to tell if they have heads or not, you know? Sometimes it's just... Mirror, mirror on the wall. Who's the prettiest of them all, Iwi? Oh, my inventory is freaking full, though! Is there a faster way to, to change your weapons? Yeah, that one. Well, that was a zombie. Around here, maybe? <gasps> okay, cut it with a knife. Yes! The tips. The tips. Thank you, Alexa. Shame I can't get my own knife back, though. I wonder if I reload, it swaps out the... Oh! I see, I see, I see. It takes it from the... Got it, got it, got it, got it, got it. Okay, 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 okay. Ooh, hello. I can't pick it up because my inventory is full. Is there anything I can do about that? Like, obviously, I don't want to drop stuff I might need. And, and Not that I can even drop anything anyway. But, like... Locked on the other side. I unlocked it. What did I unlock it with? Wait, can I even use this? Oh my god, I did. Oh, I used it. Oh well, it's fine. What is this? I will take the golden arrow. Oh, <gasps> I know where that goes. That goes in the graveyard. That goes to the graveyard. I know that. I saw the arrow etching thingy on the tombstone. I'm big brain. Oh, this comes to here. Okay, cool. Okay, time to go to the graveyard then, use the arrow there on the tomb. Tombstone, Timmy Weemy, Stony Wony. Yeah, don't. Don't let me know. Don't let me know. Don't tell me. Don't tell me. Sure I am. Hey, look, I'm big brain. Leave me, let me have this. <laughs> let me have this, Alexa. Not let me have this. Team engraved the picture of an angel as an indentation in the shape of the arrowhead. Ah, fudge. <laughs> You're all good, Vic. You're all good. You're good. Don't worry about it. It won't fit as is. Do I combine it with the... Dang. <laughs> Wait, I combine it with the knife. Uh, okay, hold on. Let's examine it. Maybe there's something about it. The arrowhead looks like it can be removed. Oh, well, there we go. Right, of course, it was just the shape of the arrowhead. Boop! You are the one who looks for other meaning behind it. Wait, what? Wait, what? Creepy. Well, I want to know what's happening behind there. It's not letting me know. The flames are dancing wildly. What is this? A stone statue with a hole where the eyes should be. A stone statue with holes where the eyes, nose, and mouth should be. A stone statue with a hole where the nose should be. A statue with a hole where the mouth should be.
A book is fitted perfectly in indentation. Will I take the book of curses? The following inscription is carved. An eye for an eye, a tooth for a tooth. Well, I hope I don't have to give up any of my teeth. There's a key embedded in the back cover. Give me that key. Book of Curses. The Four Masks. A mask that speaks no evil, that smells no evil, sees no evil. A mask that cannot speak, smell, or see evil. When all four fall into place, evil will awaken. Lovely. N now, what do you mean now we know what's going to kill me? I've picked my poison. Chen is moving. Where could it lead? Death. It leads to death. Well, I have a mansion key now. So... Oh, it's the sword! It's the sword, Uwu! That's the sword key that fits in all the sword places. This one opens on the other side, right? Yeah, cool. Just making sure, because I couldn't remember. The uh, camera angles are like super wonky, which I guess is like the entire point, and I love that. Um... Okay. It's locked. This is a helmet, so that's not going to help me. I think this room had either a sword or an armor. I don't remember which one it was. It was probably a sword. Zombie boy is missing. We love that. I use the sword key. The animation of a door opening. Really? I I find it unique, but I guess how it can like get annoying after a while, right? It's just a loading screen. That's what it is. It's a loading screen. But I can totally see how it'd get annoying. Sculptures and bits of. Hopefully, that's not no zombie or anything. That's gonna bite me on the way back, I know it. Find it freaky? I mean, I guess it's sort of the point, right? Because it's a horror game, it's trying- everything's trying to be freaky. Right? You an impatient person? Yeah, no, that's- I- I get it, I get it. Oh boy. You used a lockpick. This goes outside. Zombie dogs! I can't carry anymore. Oh my god. There's still plenty of kerosene left? Kerosene and zombie dogs? Okay. Good to know what's out there. A lot of plants, kerosene, a bag of something or other, and zombie dogs. I... I do I combine those? I I feel like I have two completely useless items that I probably should not have picked up. To be completely honest. Because they're just taking up inventory space and I can't do anything about it. It's full of dirty water. Remove the plug. Oh, goodness. Nah, no, it's fine, Alexa. I'll, I'll find out things of myself. I, I don't want to be told, like, what to do and things. I'll work it out. There's a dead body in there. Or a zombie body. Oh, <gasps> no. Oh, I thought it was the guy that we know. Step on him. Good. I thought there was something behind her. It was just the freaking... Oh, she's going to vomit. It doesn't look like it's been serviced in a while. Yeah, and you just vomited right inside it. Good work. Hey, another knife. I will take the dagger. Yay. Looks like the water still works. He was just trying to take a bath. Yeah, I know. How fudging rude of me. Actually, I don't trust that he's dead. Even though he was killed in a cutscene. <clears throat> yeah, he's dead. He's, 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 he's dead. He's dead. We're good. He's dead. Oh my god, camera. Thank you. He's dead. 
Stab his dad. Yeah, I mean, look, we don't know if he's going to get back up. Stab him while he's down. Uh, okay. Moving on this way. We just got some paint. I thought the door wasn't going to open for a second. Look, it's time. This is a really interestingly square room, and it has me concerned a little bit. Okay, there are traces of something burnt here, an acrid smell permeates the air. Always make sure something killed stays dead. Oh, 100%. 100%. Hey, more save juice. Take the ink ribbons. We need to be able to save. Another dagger. Take that. I need to protect myself. Oh, there's a shotgun. My inventory's full. <laughs> Dang. Okay, I know where the shotgun is, though. I know where the shotgun is, so I can come back for it. Um... I can come back for it, and that's what matters. I do have shotgun ammo, yes. I do. I have six shots. Hold on, okay, so there, oh my God. There's nothing on the shelf. It's locked. Spencer family emblem is carved into the doorknob. Is this the Spencer family emblem? It's not. <laughs> it's not the Spencer family emblem. Oh boy. Okay, now we swap to this, and we get ready to st stabby stab. Yeah, you'd better stay down. Get him. <laughs> View the map for a sec. I mean, it's a pretty big map. It's a pretty big map. Um, and there are a lot of places I can go and a lot of things that I haven't collected, but that's okay. I don't know if I went into this door. I don't think I did. I'm going in now. I definitely didn't. I would have remembered that super long door handle. Like, are you kidding me? That's a long door handle. Oh, oh that's a zombie. No, fudge you. I was murdering you, you fudger. I hear another one. I see him. I can see you. Oh, come on. Come on. Man, now I only have one knifey knife left. That's no bueno. No bueno, por favor. <laughs> um, one knife. Kerosene, a save. Game spot. Oh, storage. That's a storage. Okay. Emblem, blue gemstone, first aid spray. Okay. Oh, God. Shotgun shells. Okay, we'll take the handgun magazine. And we'll take the ink ribbons. A 
Supreme King, hello, Wee Wee, how are you? Hope you're doing well. Welcome, welcome. How are things? How are you? I wouldn't say learned about them so much as... Um... Didn't really have much of an option. There's still plenty of kerosene left. Yeah, but... No typewriter, okay. I don't like how ink ribbons are needed to save. <laughs> no, I, I know Alexa, but like, I thought I shot him enough times so I could just stabby stab and it didn't work. It didn't work. So I've learned my lesson now. So I'll probably like forget and screw it up anyway. <laughs> How you doing though, uh, Supreme King? Did I ask? I don't know. I'm asking again. Hope you're doing well. I'm going to go back for the shotgun because I know it's there now. The doorknob looks like it's ready to fall apart, go through anyway. Oh, you know, you know, maybe I shouldn't. I tend to make the same mistakes. So I know it's fine. It's fine. It's really no problem. I think if I go this way, I can quickly make it back to where I uh, left off. There's no knob in this door. You can't go through. Oh. So I'm guessing that door knob, I can take it off the bottom door and then put it in the top door. That would make sense. But then it will probably mean I can't go through the uh, bottom door. What is this? Will I take the wooden mount? Eh? There's nothing unusual. I think this whole freaking mount is a little unusual, but okay, game. Okay. Will I take the dog whistle? A crumpled memo. Today, Sir Spencer told me to hide something when no one would find it. I had this idea. I figured if I could somehow have it protected by a dangerous animal like the vicious canine that lives here, no one would be able to get near it. As far as I can tell, it's always hanging around the second floor balcony on the west side of the terrace and you ought to come running at the sound of a dog whistle. That's where you come in. The thing is, I reckon you're the only person that can get near that dog without risking a serious mauling. Which means only you can put this collar on him. Oh my god. You're the only person I can trust with this. Oh no. Oh no. There's your hydro. There's a collar I gotta put on him? On a dog? A collar I gotta put on the dog? A chessboard? The game appears to have ended in a checkmate. That sucks to suck. Someone lost. I'm afraid the record is Jupiter. An open journal. Pages are blank. Useful. Can't carry any more items. Of course I can't. Why would I be able to? Oh no, yeah, yes, just a little bit, just a little bit of an oh no right now, Alexa. Okay, so this door opens up and then the other side doesn't have a door handle. Right? Yeah, there's no doorknob, I can't go through. Oh boy. And there's also a dog around. Probably better if I don't understand. I don't like the sound of that. It's locked, an emblem of armor. Man, I hate this. There's nothing here but a bunch of knickknacks. Knickknacks! Locked, emblem of armor. Use the sword key. Patience? Yeah, no, I know, I just gotta be patient. That's the wrong button. Okay, so. Um. 
I should be going back to the item box because I really... Actually, no, I should probably use the sword key for all the things I need to use it on. By blowing into it, it generates frequencies only audible to the ears of dogs. You can call a dog with this whistle. I'll save that for later. Um, I need to use up the sword key as much as I can. Because I want to be able to dump it and say that I'm done with it and I don't need it anymore. That would be very convenient because it takes up a stupid item spot. I'm not good with item management in these games at all. Uh, I'm really not. So, yeah. Now, did I go down? I don't remember. It's locked on the other side. Okay, that one was locked. I think this one was an armor key, right? Yeah. Armor. Okay. So we gotta go the other- wait, didn't I not go the other way? I did, because that took me to the second floor. But there may be more locked doors. Ah, uh, this way that I didn't have before, because I didn't have the key. Resident Evil is- Oh, it's the crows. Oh my god. But there weren't any crows before, or ravens. Why are they here now? And should I be scared of them? I feel like I absolutely should be. Um, they're terrifying. Uh, I don't like that. I don't like terrifying things. Okay. I didn't go into this room. No comment. Thank you, Alexa. I, I do appreciate that. I don't want to be spoiled. There's an inscription on the shield. Death is only the beginning. Cool, thanks. Oh, this just goes up to... Is this a trap? Death is the true essence of bliss. Oh, that thing's gonna kill me if I pick it up. Not that I can, because my inventory is freaking full. But I'll note that down for later. Hey! You go up there, that thing gonna spike you to death! <laughs> like, that- you can see that's just gonna move around and kill whoever's, like, standing there. Which will be me. I'll be standing there. Lots on the other side. Looks on the other side. Did I actually go through like this entire area? I must have. I must have gone through the whole thing then. I used the sword key. Okay, that's probably the last. Will I know if I've used up all the keys? Because I know in the um in Resident Evil 2 it tells you when you've used the key as many times as you need to. It doesn't, either it doesn't tell me, or, I mean, if you die, at least you'll know how it works. Alexa, hush, tell me nothing. I used the lock pick. Ah, oh, fudge. Here we go. <laughs> <gasps> no, wait, this is where the dog is. Right? They said the dog was on the west balcony, right? This is the west side of the house, and this is where the balcony- Hold up, I gotta double check. I gotta double check my files. Okay, where was it? Protected by- Okay, uh-huh. He's hanging around the second floor balcony. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. The only person who can get near- Okay, 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 okay. So I gotta put a collar on him, but I don't have a collar. So I'm just not- Oh, it's a zombie. I thought it was a dog. Oh my god, the panic I just had. Oh, shit, they're talking.
Oh, I shot up in the air by accident? Wait, is that guy actually dead? Oh, this, this one's actually dead. Okay, that works then. That's okay. I'm okay with that. Okay, the question is, do I go down here? I can. Well, I could check out these other two rooms. Let's check out the other two rooms. It's locked. An emblem of a helmet. Okay, that's a helmet that I don't have. You've unlocked it. Oh, I don't know if I'm gonna like this. That's a creepy looking door. I don't know how I feel about this door. Wait a minute. Haven't I been here? Oh, I have. It's the it's the door that goes back to here. Sweet. Okay, cool. Hey, Caleb. Hello, wee wee. How are you? Hope you're doing well. Are you, are you proud of me, Caleb? I said I'd play this game. I'm playing the game. Are you proud of me? How you doing, Caleb? Everything could kill you here. Why even bother? Thanks. Appreciate it. Oh. You may not be dead? You're dead. You love this game? Yeah. I'm just trying. I've only been playing it for about uh, an hour. The wooden boxes are covered in bloodstains. Looks like this one's been dead for several hours. So, um, it's great. I'm a little all over the place because, like, what the fudge is going on? How do I do anything? Do I have a whole bunch of items that I probably don't need? Uh, this is another typewriter. Excellent. What the fudge is tank controls? I don't know what that means. I don't even know what that means! Sure thing, Alexa. Have yourself a great day. I think you said work. Have yourself a good time and I'll catch you later. The dog whistle I probably need, so I'm just gonna dump it for now. It's in the options. The options had... Fudge, where was it? They had two options. Alternate and original. Every movement is relative to your character. Uh, no, I much prefer being able to... Relative to camera. Because relative to character would probably, like, mess me up. I'd probably get so confused. I'd probably get so confused. Although I will say the camera swapping is unfortunate and probably would be solved by using tank controls, but... To each their own. Yeah, no, that's what I'm thinking. Like, tank controls would probably solve the changing angle thing, but... It's... it's... it is what it is, you know? There's nothing but cleaning products inside. It smells faintly unpleasant. Yeah, bleach does smell unpleasant. How are you doing anyway, Caleb? Hope you're doing well. I mean, look, I've gotten used to playing it this way for the past hour now, so I'm gonna stick with it, you know? At least when you change camera angle anyway. Oh, hello, what are you? Will you take the battery pack? Sure, I know what it does, but I'll take it. Will you take the broken shotgun? Yes. Oh, is this like the fudging part in Resident Evil 2 where you have to put the broken shotgun down the freaking replacement spot? Otherwise it like doesn't like it. There's still plenty of kerosene left. Probably is. Probably is like that. And I've got a broken shotgun now. Lovely. Actually, let's see if there's anything special about it. Well, it's broken and can't be fired. Maybe there's another use for this. Well, I'm assuming there's not going to be a, a box next to every single typewriter, is there? Is there? Is there a box next to every typewriter? Because if so, I'll dump the ink ribbons in the box. 
Pretty much. Because I know the first typewriter in the game doesn't have one next to it. So I just assumed they don't. Oh. Was that a spoiler? I don't know. I wouldn't say that was a spoiler. I just didn't think it would have. Uh, I don't know what to do with those items, so I'll just leave them in here for now. I need to find the collar before I can use the dog whistle. 90% of them are containing boxes. Awesome, that's good then. Question is, where do I find the collar? Hmm. What if the collar... Oh my god, is the collar up on the freaking second floor? Third floor? That better not be what the freaking shield of spiky death is going to do to me. Guess we'll find out. This is the wrong way. Sure thing, Caleb. Thank you very much. All I want to know at the moment is if I try to pick up whatever this is, will that kill me? Because this looks like, if I even touch it, it looks like it's a trigger mechanism, right? That if I pick that up, this thing's gonna fudging vroom 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 along and just wablamos, I'm dead, right? Unless I'm on this side of it, because I'm a smart bean. May whoever takes a symbol and find peace and death. Oh, fudge my life. It comes from the side. I got fooled. Oh, fudging. Fudge, fudge. Fudge, fudge, fudge. Fudgy, fudge. Oh, uh, hey. Let's put that back real quick. <laughs> Actually, I have a big brain move, right? Big brain move. Big brain move. Okay, big brain, big brain move right now. You guys watch, watch, watch this big brain play. I'm gonna do it, I'm gonna do what's called an Indiana Jones. I cannot do an Indiana Jones. Um, well, that's unfortunate. <laughs> that is unfortunate. Okay, there's got to be another way to, to get away with from this mechanism, though. Death is everything. Find peace and death. Death is everything. Am I meant to die? I'm one of a helmet. Maybe I'm meant to die. What if I go down, save my game, and then see if I die? You know? Yeah, let's just let's just put that back. Um, not if it's a spoiler. Death is only the beginning. I'm gonna try and save and then die. That's what I'm gonna try and do. I think this is where I've forgotten where the last save point was, if I'm being honest. Navigating this map. Navigating Resident Evil maps is... The game will ask me... Okay, cool. That's what I, that's what I was wondering earlier, as I was wondering if I'm going to be, like, questioned on it or not. That is the wrong button. I will take the green herb. the wrong button oh fudge wait i went the wrong way ah yeah thank you very much because i know resident evil 2 and 7 do that so that's good to know good to know and there's no risk of like skipping a door and having the game think i've gotten past it already because i went somewhere else right like it's just going to be straight up nah you don't need this you're good Awesome. Cool, cool, cool.
Okay, I know I already know that one's been dead for several hours. <laughs> I did, but I want to test, um, dying to the, the, the thing, right? And I'd rather save now than, um, die and have to go a very far way back. And hey, if I'm not, if I don't die here and I play it right, then hey, even better, even better. It probably the the probably spiky shield thing probably goes all the way up to me and then just stops, right? That's my thinking progress process. Wooden mount. I'm just trying to work out if like any of this is gonna help me. Like I don't think it will. Maybe the first aid spray if I take a hit. <laughs> That will work. That will work wonders. Let's go give death a shot, ladies and gentlemen. Let's go try dying. I am a fan of the death and the murder. Let's go try and do some of it. For your entertainment pleasure. You know, maybe I will try tank controls. Oh, but I don't like the whole turning around thing. Self-murder. Exactly, Vic. So you understand. Zlayton, hello, Wee Wee. How are you? Hope you're doing well. Welcome, welcome. Yeah, I saw the quick turn. Like, look at this. Look at this quick turn. You ready? You ready? You ready for quick turn? Quick, 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 quick turn? Qua. Qua. Look at that quick turn. Okay. Wait, why can't I run, though? Why am I not running anymore? Is there no... Oh, I have to hold square to run. That's right. They make you hold square to run in the original. I went the wrong way. I'm running into a wall. This is what happens when you make me change my control scheme and I already got used to one. <laughs> I didn't, yeah, the, the run button doesn't need to be held on the uh, newer control scheme. Hey, let's go give death a shot. I will take the mansion key. And I am prepared to face my destiny. Um, let's have an examination. It's engraving of armor. Cool. Good old fashioned Australian go. Okay, here we go. Time for death. Oh, wow. You just, you do straight up die. Get used to it. You are dead. I mean, hey, look, it was worth a shot, right? Maybe I wouldn't have died, right? It said death is only the beginning. That is my first death, but it was a purposeful death, right? And because it was purposeful, I n it doesn't count. I accepted that I was probably gonna die and I did. So it's okay. Hooray. I also don't like tank controls. I've made up my mind. Fudge tank controls. <laughs> I fear can't kill you, but yeah, I've decided I don't like tank controls. Yeah, exactly. I gave it a go. I gave it a red hot shot. If people even say that anyway. And that's what counts. Well, I mean, technically, even if I didn't give it a go, that would be what counted. So, well, it wouldn't be what counted, but like my rule is law. My word is law, whatever. So I'm guessing there's probably something we can replace the, uh, the thing with then. 
bright. Okay, where do I find the shotgun? The shotgun was all the way on the other side. Which is, yep, back this way. You know, while I'm at it, I put away the dog whistle, never mind. I was gonna say, while I'm at it, I may as well just call the dog. You know what, fudge it, while I'm at it, I'm not even gonna call the dog. I'm just gonna fudging run outside. I'm gonna die to this dog, and I'm gonna die on purpose. That way, I can say I tried. Wait, is there actually no dog here until I call it? I thought there was meant to be a dog hanging out. Some kind of thorny plant I've never seen before. I thought there was meant to be a dog roaming this balcony. Huh! Huh! <laughs> so much for a dog roaming the balcony! You've never beat it? Is that because you don't have it? Or is it because, like, you just couldn't ever finish it? I want to know why you couldn't beat it. Okay, yeah, let's go down and just grab the shotgun. That's not down. This is down. Because you never got around to it? That's fair. Well, I'm planning on beating it. Because I said so. Guessing this doesn't use the key. Yeah, helmet. Well, we know where the armor key is, which is great. Um... Went to bed, woke up, and forgot where you were meant to go? Oof. That's a fudging F right there. That's a rip, Caleb. That's a rip. I mean, to be fair, I didn't even know where I'm meant to go now, so you know it's fine. Let's go grab that shotgun. Because now I have the fake shotgun. I'm assuming it's like in Resident Evil 7, right? Where you have to grab the shotgun off the wall, but then it like locks you into the room and you have to replace it with a fake shotgun. Also, why is this entire area so it's like not fully checked out? Which of the mansion suspended in darkness. Various sculptures and bits of pottery. Reminds you of the time you got lost 40 hours in Dragon Quest 11. Yikes. I don't know what any of that supposedly means. Yeah, it says this whole room is, like, not fully searched, but I don't see anything in here that, like, is worth checking out anyway? Interesting. There was that, like, bit where, like, the window smashed earlier, so maybe something else is gonna, like, come flying through the window later. I don't know. Uh... I have not done a whole playthrough of Stardew. I've played Stardew Valley. Um, I've played it a fair... No, I, I don't say a fair bit. I've maybe gotten through, like, the first few months of the game. And by first few, I mean, like, maybe two months. I just never really played much of it. Seems like I got wiped. Oof. No, no, no. Don't tell me anything, Caleb. This is a puzzle game with horror elements. I will discover on my own. Betrayal, I know. Okay, and then we put the fake shotgun down. No. What? Well, I set the shotgun. Wait, what about the fake shotgun? Oh, you know what it is? I probably have to access it from my menu here and then use it. There we go. I don't actually know what that does though, but now I have a shotgun. So, suck it, game. <laughs> I can't believe Resident Evil 7 just stole the puzzle from Resident Evil. Actually reusing it? Shaking my head, my head. Shaking my head, my head. I put the ammo back in the box, didn't I? I totally did too, didn't I? Yep, I absolutely freaking did. Good thing there's another box in like a few rooms. Exactly. Shaking my head, my head. See, Vic gets it.
Okay, let's see what's in here. It's locked. Emblem of armor. And up this way... Oh, I didn't check this room here. Hold up. It's locked. The Spencer family emblem. Uh, yeah, that's unfortunate. Oh, I don't like this gate. Oh, this is not a good gate. This this is not a friend. This is not a friend. Do you guys think this is a friend? Is this a secret? If I'm playing as Jill? <gasps> oh, fudge my life. Oh, this boy is just gonna eat me. Not a friend? Yeah, not a friend. Okay, I killed him though. I killed him. And I'm- apparently I'm very fine. I am incredibly fine. My arm not even hurt. What's this? There's something written in the indentation. The defile of the accursed coffin. Eh. Sure, do it. It's locked. Okay. Well? But what's the secret with the shotgun? Let me guess, I had to try leaving the room first to see the secret, didn't I? And I just didn't do that, because I was too smart. Try to grab the shotgun without replacing it, Barry will come and save you? What? I missed out on Barry?! Man, can't believe I missed out on Barry. This is the worst trade deal in the history of trade deals maybe ever. Only if you haven't received the grenade launcher from him? There's a grenade launcher- Way to spoil it while trying not- while trying not to spoil, Caleb. Way to spoil it while trying not to spoil! Wow. Wow, Caleb. Wow. You actually- you're- you're just dumb, is what- that's what that is. That's just dumb. Don't worry, no one else will ever see that spoiler ever again. Unless they, you know, see it in the chat over there. Ban me, I guess. You're getting banned now. Suck it. Actually, don't. The fuel canteen. Oh, I can get kerosene in that. Actually, don't, please. You're getting banned. I'm sorry, this is just how it works. Um... That was the wrong button. Combine. We gonna make the weed. A fudge? You made it no, Caleb, you're okay. I know you didn't mean to. It's fine. I know you didn't mean to. It's okay. It's okay. Maybe that- I'm thinking maybe that's the, the coffin defiler. Maybe. Oh, fudge and no. There's still plenty of kerosene left. Refill your fuel canteen. You refilled it with kerosene. Why? There's still some kerosene left, but why do I want this to be filled with kerosene? Am I gonna light things on- <gasps> Oh my god, there was a lighter in another room, wasn't there? There was two. Uh, I have not seen Barry since the start of the game. <laughs> I'm actually- I don't have enough shells for the shotgun, I have plenty of ammo, so I'm gonna dump uh, the shotgun stuff in here. I need to pick up the lighter, for sure. And this bugs me not being, like, in line. There we go. Oh, I need- Duh, I need to actually save my game. Grab my ink ribbon. Nice, chill, relaxing music for a game that's gonna fudging murder me. I'm just saying, for a game that's gonna murder me, this music's very relaxing. Actually, you know what else I'm gonna do? The music almost feels kinda eerie. Oh, it's definitely eerie. But it's like that relaxing sort of eerie, right? 
Also, let me take this doorknob. The doorknob's gonna fall off. Oh! It didn't fall off? I feel like I've made a mistake. I feel like I've made a mistake and, like, wasted one of my backtracking uh, abilities, like, things. I feel like I have a limited amount of backtracks, is what I'm trying to say, and I feel like I just wasted one of them. Because there's no doorknob on that door for some reason. I expected the doorknob to fall off immediately, and it didn't. So... That's a yikes, is what I'm trying to say. It's a yikes. Unless it's like a, a, a flat chance each time you go through the door, which would be fine. There's your hydro. Open journal and the pages are blank. Wait, I didn't want to do that because I wanted to, because I'm going to be going through the door anyway. I don't know. I'm going through the door anyway. I'm actually so glad that um, Fudging, for those of you who actually want to play the Resident Evil series, um, Fudging, there is a huge sale of, of, uh, on them on PlayStation at the moment. Like, I got Resident Evil 3 for 30 bucks instead of 90. Big sale. And, like, Resident Evil 5 and 6 are, like, $20 off as well. Caleb for the transgressions! Uh, how long is the timeout again? I've forgotten how long the timeout is for. Where is time someone out? For one minute. Caleb. It was a pleasure meeting you. <laughs> I'll be back. <laughs> he will be back, it's fine. Words of Covenant. Don't play with fire, love Jessica. Caleb got yeeted. That is, I haven't had someone time someone out for ages. Feels good. Sorry, Caleb, you were an unwitting victim, but you were a victim nonetheless. <laughs> uh, I actually didn't want to go this way. I'm dumb. I wanted to go the other way in the first place. But I'm big stupid. Wonder who's gonna get prosecuted? It'll be Supreme King, won't it? It's totally gonna be Supreme King. We're gonna have a fudging whole trial. We're gonna have a whole trial. I feel like, and here's my thoughts. Let me know what you guys uh, think, because I think this is a good thought. I've been wondering how to do prosecutor viewer. I feel like doing it on stream sort of doesn't really work out. So what if we were to do the, the viewer prosecutions and, and court trials and stuff in the Discord? We can all get in the voice chat, we can all present our arguments, I'll be the judge. Oh no, I'm the judge, Vic. There is no jury. I'm the judge. Well, maybe I was going to prosecute myself. Yeah, maybe not anymore. <laughs> there don't seem to be any houses in the area. You act surprised, Jill. An unlit fireplace. Can I light it with my lighter? I actually can. Mine's comes with a leaf glow, glow red in the heat. Wait, but that just looks like a map. You'll sit in the audience and gasp it dramatically. Yeah, yeah, I like it, I like it, I like it. That works, that works. That works, that works very well. You can, you can do that. Like, that's a map, right? But I'm trying to work out how I can, like, can I take notes of this map? You're just about to hint? That's a map! I'm just trying to work out how I can, like, note it down. Can I even note it down? Wait a minute, that's mirrored. The map is reversed. The map is reversed. The map is reversed. Guys, I don't think you know that I know, but I know the map is reversed. You can tell because the balcony there is at the bottom left, but on here, it's like this side. But also you can tell the stairs at the top as well, right? The stairs at the top as well. You can check. Is on the left side there, 
But on the map here, it's on the right side. I'm big fudging bread. And the big room that we haven't explored, like that that one right there, that we haven't explored, is on is on the other side. So anyway, as I'm saying, I'm a fudging smart. It's locked, an emblem of a helmet. Okay, well, I may be smart, but this room is dead end. That fire is hot. That fire is hot. No hints, Caleb. No hints. Okay, so the question is, where do I go next? I'm going to guess the balcony, because I have this, and I'm hoping that's, like, maybe what I'm after. When does this window open? I don't remember. Right, right, yeah, 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 I'm big brain, big brain. Wait a minute, I never checked this painting. I should check the painting. Is it Jesus's Last Supper? A woman mourning in front of a large crowd. Boring. Everyone knows Jesus's Last Supper is the best painting. It's not even called Jesus's Last Supper, it's just The Last Supper. See, that's how smart I am. <laughs> what am I saying? I'm spouting nonsense. Passing it off as fact. No, actually, maybe... What if it's not this emblem? What if the emblem's not the answer? And I've come all this way, and it's just, like, not it. Like, what if? Also, why didn't... I have a knife equipped. Why didn't that work on the... I have a- sorry, I have a stun gun. Sorry, I- sorry, does that say I have a stun gun? I don't remember picking up a stun gun, is all I'm gonna say on the matter. And that's it. That's all that's going to be said, is I don't remember picking up a stun gun. That's all we need to say. Also, this is the balcony, and I'm a fool. I did not want to go to the balcony. I wanted to go to... Where was the fudge? I've forgotten where the... It was out the right side, wasn't it? Oh, fudge. It's powered by batteries. Oh, that's why I picked up a battery. I think... I realize I'm going all over the place. Zip zap, exactly. Zip zippy zappy zappy. Zippy zippy zappy zappy. Zippy zippy zoopy zoopa whoopa. Zoopa doopa. Any Australians know what zoopa doopas are? Man, that was childhood right there, am I right, guys? Only Australians would understand zoopa doopas. Vic, I see you. You know what a zoopa doopa is. <laughs> they are the best. Ba black current fudge, yes. It's L2. It's L2. But for some reason, it just didn't work for the dog. <laughs> I got bit by that dog before, and it just, the knife didn't work. Because I've already used two of them on zombies. I got in close quarters. Alexa was yelling at me about it. Don't even, it's fine. <laughs> it's, it's fine. Old fashioned gramophone. Okay. Uh, hold, hold, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. I feel like I've missed an item. I mean, I definitely have missed an item somewhere. Because it's telling me this room hasn't been fully, like, you know, done, did? Oh! Apparently I never read the book here. So one fact that there exists many plants that are created with medicinal healing powers since ancient times mankind have been using healing wellness as used in various plants in this book called Sample Three Herbs of the Native of the Arkley Mountains. Briefly outlining each of the medicinal qualities of these herbs is in color and distinct medical quality. Green herb is in its physical strength. The blue is neutral toxins. The red is no effects by itself. We mix it together and make results in a maximified effect. Well, outlining the effects of red herbs. Okay, so I don't know what that is. Okay, so I think the outside was like that part on the right there, right? So if I just go back there, 
One can hope. At least I think where that that's where that was. Fudge if I don't remember a god dang thing. Because I don't. <laughs> what I am going to do first, though, is I'm going to see if there's... A, like, the wooden mount may be useful. Um, gemstone might be as well. Dog whistle. I feel like I just got to use the dog whistle. But, like, there's a collar I meant to add to it, right? Okay, let's see. I... I... Hold on. Let's just try combining random junk. Nope. 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 Okay. Great. Has Ron Ribbon looked down back about 15? No, I had 15 the whole time, Vic. You're you're imagining things. I always had 15. Like any one of these things could be used for the graveyardy bit. Fudge, man. I don't know. It's probably super easy, like, and obvious, right? Because the file up here specifically said, Hey, West Balcony. Um, let's hang around the second floor balcony in the west side. Come running and sound of the dog whistle. You reckon the only person to get in there without risking mulling, which means you can put this collar on him. Oh, wait! The collar's already on the dog! Oh, 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 oh. The collar's already on the dog and it has something in it. I gotta call the dog and get the collar. Right, 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 righty. Alrighty. Don't worry, Caleb, I used that big brain of mine. I used that big brain. I used that big brain of mine. I got the big brainy wainy. No, no, see, I've read that before. I was under the impression that I had to add a collar to the dog and get something out of the collar by doing so. No, that's the exact opposite of what I need to do. <laughs> I need to take the collar from a dog because the collar is already on the dog. Big brain time. I didn't take the key back that I probably need, right? That's ah, fine. It's it's not fine. I want that key. I'm gonna I'm gonna take the key back. <laughs> Just in case, you know. Yeah, yeah, no, because I thought I thought that um the person didn't receive the message yet, so I was like, oh yeah. I gotta I gotta put the, the thing on the dog because he didn't get the message, so I gotta do it. No, no, the message was delivered and he did put the thing on the dog. I need to take the collar off the dog. With my big brain. Let's do this. Wait, am I going the right way? Yes. Okay, let's head out because we're gonna get the collar from the dog that's probably gonna have a key or something important in it that we need to continue on with our our journey or the collar is gonna have a look-alike key that I can put on the thing upstairs so that, that way I don't die from the stabby stabby shieldy boy Okay, here we go, ladles and gentlemen. Ladles and gentlemans. I blew the dog whistle. Stabs! Oh, fudge is another one. No, down! Ah, fudge, I shot up at the sky instead of down on the ground. Ugh. 
You fudging wood run off. Oh god! Oh my god! Game is too hard! Game too hard! <laughs> I wonder how much ammo I have. Oh, caution! Oh no! There's a switch. Yeah, I'll press the switch. A coin was hidden inside the collar. There's nothing unusual. It changed into the shape of a key! It's an imitation of a key, I knew it! I knew it! I was right too, I said the exact thing it would turn into. I was like, oh, it's probably gonna turn into a fake key so I can replace it with a fudging shield. And I was right! Yes, discard the dog whistle. <laughs> I'm big brain! Guys, are you proud of how big brain I am? I'm proud. I'm proud of how big brain I am. I'm gonna go steal the first aid spray. <laughs> you're proud. Dang right, you're proud, Caleb. If you're not proud of me, I'd have to cancel you. I'm sorry, those are just the rules. Oh, now my stun gun's out because I used the last of my thing. And all without your help? I know, it's because I'm big brain. I thought we established this. <laughs> I'll have to prosecute you for not being proud. No, I just ban you. Sorry, but that's just how it is, you know? If you're not proud, you get a ban. I don't make the rules. Actually, yes, I do. Imagine telling you I don't make the rules. What a funny joke. Actually, do I want to take the mixed herbs instead? I'll take the mixed herbs instead. Hey, I'm fine now. Can we go? I'm fine. Mighty fine. Okay. Let us save our game. I hope I'm not using too many ink ribbons, but like, I have a habit of having to save constantly. Because if I don't, I screw up and I, I hate, I despise backtracking. I despise it. So maybe present me is going to screw over uh, future me when I run out of ink ribbons. But th I figure, like, I have 13 ink ribbons left. Like, I'm not even at risk of running out anytime soon. So why even worry about it, you know? Just use them all. Anyway. Let's go up to that, uh, second floor room. We're gaming gamers. Look at us game, like true gamers. I'm always at risk. The fudge is that meant to mean, Vic? Huh? Bitches? Yeah, I'm. my beard is... It's not even a full fudging beard, but it makes me god dang itchy as hell. Problem is, I can't be stuffed shaving because I'm lazy. So I'm just constantly in, like, pain. Also, I love how uh, my freaking stream closed captioner senses fudging. Because it can't tell that I'm not swearing. So it's just like, you said fudging! That's a sensor right there! It's only sometimes though. I don't know why. It seems to have an issue with actually understanding what I'm saying. It's because I'm Australian. Doesn't understand the Australian accent. It's disappointing, really. Let's see what's behind door number one. What accent? What do you mean, what accent? You've just gotten used to it, Supreme King. There is a very real Australian accent. It has dyslexia text, would you? Look at that. You've been here too long and you can't hear it. Amazing. Well, fudge off, for starters.
For starters, I fudging knifed him the other time. I knifed him last time. That's fudging nonsense. Right, now I've got nothing. I will not take the green herb, actually, because then I can't take the key up front. Ten, only ten months in a week? That's crazy. And Supreme King, two years and five months? Next, you guys know that next, well, some of you don't know. Next month is, uh, next month will mark my three years of streaming on Twitch. You've been Australian for two and a half years now? Mm-hmm. Watch the fake key not work. Just fudging watch. Hell yeah. Big brains. Let's go. Oh, I definitely will. 100% will, Vic. When? I don't know. I gotta work out when my actual, like, when the actual day is, because I keep forgetting when the actual day I started streaming was. <laughs> like, I do it every time. I forget what day I started streaming. Every single freaking year. Okay, let me take one of these herbs. I wish I could take the other one and, like, combine it. Like, right now on the fly, but I can't, and that makes me slightly upset. Let's go this way, and there should be a door that I can hopefully open. Oh, fudge my fudging life. I stabbed these guys earlier. Why are they coming back? Ah, fudge. <laughs> fudge. No. <laughs> I stabbed them earlier and they were dead. See? Nothing. And now you're telling me all my stabbings before don't matter? Now I just use the herb out, right? I can, and it only heals a little bit. Noted. Well, no time like the present to die like the past. Or something. No time like the present to die in the future. We'll go with it. Fudging, fudger. Imagine having full health. I know. You fudge. Let me shoot. It wouldn't let me shoot. No. American healthcare, Jeebus. Oh my God, he run. Jeepers, man. That is illegal. That is illegal. Why did I come back this way anyway? Danger? Yeah, yeah, I'm not- why am I not surprised? <laughs> okay, well down this way is some fudging health for me. Got a first aid spray. <laughs> I don't like how the zombies that I've confirmed as dead by stabbing them on the ground can come up and attack me as as if they weren't. Not the biggest fan of it at all, actually. Oh boy. I'm not going to save there 
because I screwed up and used a bunch of healing. So if I die and then I have to reload to save, I'm technically ahead, which is exactly where I want to be. Technically. Wait, was that a... That's a dead end. Okay, cool. Hey, look at me go. I don't know where this door go, but I go through the door. Oh, that's a battery. Fudge, yes. I will take the battery pack. Candlestick shines coldly in the moonlight. I don't like how creepy this is. That is a shadow of something on the window. Like, you think I haven't noticed that game? I know that's someone's shadow. You think you can fudge and get away with this sort of behavior? See, look, that's an arm moving. He's gonna smash through the, the window, I swear. It's the shadow of your former self. Kill it. What the fudge is this place? The lid in this water pump is open. Pump the water. How about not yet? that plant screw it I'm pumping the water oh you know what let's pump it green Vic and Caleb come on now how dare Yeah, honestly, I don't think that did anything for me. You share one brain cell, honestly. Let's pump it red. <sighs> nope, it still doesn't like... Okay. Hmm. Maybe I gotta put something in the water? Something it doesn't like? No, I haven't, Supreme King, I'm sorry. I don't know what I expected. <laughs> Yeet is the fetus. I forgot I said that. Hmm. No, let's pump it green first, because that probably does something, actually. How many quotes? Let's turn it green. See, I don't know exactly what the... Okay. I don't know exactly what that's doing, but it's doing something different, so, like, I don't know, man. I don't know, man. Game Pass is grounded? Nice. I have grounded, too, but I bought it, because... Whoops. I swear that... Okay, I was going to say, I swear there's a rake there. There is. You don't have a single one with all the beautiful things I've said? You'll have your time. You'll have your time. Soon, Vic. Soon. Maybe not soon. I can't guarantee it'll be soon. But it'll happen eventually at some point, maybe. I'm in someone's creepy, lovely bedroom. And there is a body on the ground. Is he dead? Probably not. Let's stab him. He is dead. He is dead. Yes, I will take that. You'll just look at all the quotes. 
The door is stuck on something and won't budge. I don't like that. <laughs> Keeper's Diary. Play poker tonight with Scott in the licensed security and Steve from Research Steve was a big winner, but I think it was cheating. One of the higher-ups assigned me to take care of the new creature. It looks like a skinned gorilla. Feeding instructions were to give it live animals. When I threw it a pig, the creature seemed to play with it, tearing off the pig's legs and pulling out the guts before it actually started eating. At around five, Scott woke me up. Scared me too? He was wearing a protective suit. He handed me another one, told me to put it on. Said there'd been an accident in the basement lab. There's no something like this would happen. The base, the, those people in the research never sleep even on holiday. I was going to say those basements in research. That's not how that works. I've been wearing the space suit since yesterday. My skin's getting grimy and feels itchy. The dogs have been looking at me funny, so I decided not to feed them today. That was the biggest fudging mistake you ever made. Now you're going to be eaten. Went to the infirmary because my back is swollen and feels itchy. They put a big bandage on it and told me I didn't need to wear the suit anymore. All I wanted to sleep. <sighs> Caleb, thank you for the host. I appreciate it. The limit of how many times I can get a quote is a scam. Wait, what? Found another big blister on my foot. I ended up dragging my foot all the way to the dog's pen. They were quiet all day, which is weird. And I realized some of them had escaped. Maybe this is their way of getting back at me for not feeding them in the last three days. Rumors going around the researcher who tried to escape the estate was shot. My entire body feels hot and itchy and I'm sweating all the time. I scratched the swelling of my arm and a piece of rotten flesh dropped off. What is happening to me? You're becoming a zombie. Fever gone but itchy. Today hungry and eat doggy food. Itchy, itchy. Scott came ugly face so I killed him. Tasty. Itchy. Tasty. I was oh, there's a zombie coming out of here. Yeah, no problem, Caleb. Oh, there are two of them. I'm not prepared for two of them. Ah, fudge, 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 fudge. And those are my two battery packs wasted. <laughs> Bro, why you kill me? I just used both the battery packs I just picked up. Gotta love that! Wait, is there still something in this room? No, there isn't. Okay, cool. Oh my god. At least now I know... Uh... Fudge. Why this door was blocked? Oh no. No, I don't. I don't know. I lied. The door is just stuck on something and won't budge, I guess. Yeah, we can't just have a quote that says we can't just have a quote that says hello, right? So fudge that room and everything in it. I didn't go down this way because this was like really hidden. <gasps> yes, give me a dagger. Give me a dagger. You love the bot. I think you just like the quote system, honestly. Also, I hate how the numbers have freaking done the thing. Because they're meant to be dates. That's meant to be the 22nd of the 3rd, 2020. But they've got rid of the hyphens. So there's an inscription. A tiger glowing with blue and yellow light. Do I need to put the gem in there? One of my jemmy boys? Jemmy Gem Jemson? Jemson? Jemmy? Jemmy Jemson? Blue and yellow light, right? I have a blue gem. I'm thinking... I don't know, probably a stretch. I've played Ace Attorney. Uh, I haven't finished the trilogy, but I played a fair bit of it and I haven't touched it in a while. Uh, simply because I haven't felt like it, if I'm being completely honest. But uh, I don't know. Maybe I'll get back to it. Maybe is not a promised. Promised is not a promise. Whatever. Expensive looking grand piano. Okay, so there's nothing there. There's something written in the corner of the picture. Commemorating completion of the mansion. Okay. Almost got scared by my own reflection. There's an aroma, uwu. I can't carry any more ink ribbons. Okay, well, I know it's here. 
Oh, fudge. Wait, what? Hello? Gotcha games own your life, fudging F. F your life, Vic? Like, that's it. You're done. <laughs> like, you're screwed. <laughs> um. Where's the nearest savey boxy? Boxy, boxy savey. Let's go back to the item box and dump some things and then pick up those things. Then your life, but not your bank account. Okay, you're okay. You're okay for now. I think what I'm going to do, guys, is I'm going to go back. I'm going to save. I'm going to pick up the, uh, sorry. I'm going to go back. I'm going to drop off some items. I'm going to pick up the ones in those rooms. Uh, and then I'm going to go back and I'm going to save. Um, and call the stream there, I reckon. I reckon. All the way to the save point. This is the way to the save point. This is the way to the save point. Yeah, for now, Vic. You're gonna, they're gonna own your bank account real soon, don't you know? Okay, let's do some item management. Don't reckon I need the kerosene or the lighter at the moment. Definitely don't need the herb. I am going to try and grab the gemstone, see if that works for the thing I'm thinking of. And I may as well take the ink ribbons because I'll be picking up another one anyway. I want to get Primogen so you can get C1 Ball on Genshin. Yes, I know what Primogens are. C1 Ball, not a clue. I'm assuming Ball is a character. I don't know what C1 means. And Primogens are, of course, the currency. Everyone knows what you spend your money on. I mean, what? <laughs> I don't know what I'm saying at this point. I'm just spouting random things, honestly. Okay, let's try the gem. Let's try to see if the gem uh, works. I spilled a thing. Spilled? Not spilled. I dropped a thing. Whatever. Hey! I'm smart. I will take the shotgun shells. Okay, so now I just need a yellow gem, and then uh, I can get the other item in that. Electro Archon of Sears, yep, I know what that means. Those are words I totally understand. <laughs> Wait, no, this is... Maths. The buffs. Right, got it, got it, got it. No, I can't, that's right, I'm not going in that room because that's the, uh, the water room with the plant that I don't understand. Okay. We're going to go grab the items in this room here, including the door opening fudging freaked me out. Yeah, I'll take the ink ribbons. Got six of them. Very nice. Very nice. Oh, I have to push it again? You're kidding me. You'd think I, like pushing it once would be fine. It stays there. The musical score for the grand piano? Surely not. Musical score. Moonlight. Oh my god, it's Moonlight Sonata. I love. I love that fudging thing. It's so sad. Alexa, play Despacito. Expensive looking grand piano. Yeah, let's let's play Moonlight Sonata. 
It's not necessary to play the fudging music right at the fudging grand piano. Bruh, what are we meant to do with it if we're not meant to- Try examining it again. Todd Midnight Sonata. Todd Midnight Sonata. Back? Once oh. I complete all these minigames, you'll never have to hear this music ever again. Like, literally never again. Nothing but love. Derp, thank you so much for the sub. I appreciate it. How are you doing today? That's a year! Derp, that's a year! Thank you so much! How are you doing, Derp? Hope you're doing well. Welcome, welcome. How are things? You did it again? No, it's fine. It's fine. I didn't realize that was a, uh, a thing, you know? Oh, because it's missing music? Oh yeah, hell yeah, we vibin'. I'm guessing I can't actually play this without the missing music bit then. Zoom! Yeah, okay. Well, in that case, and Derp, I'm sorry, because I know you literally just got here. Wait, I'm, there's still something in this room I haven't picked up? It says, oh, probably because I, I play the piano and now I get the item. Jeff as well, hello, Wee Wee, how are you? Hope you're doing well. Welcome, welcome. How are things? How are you? You need a poop. Sure thing, Derp. Yeah, as I was saying, and Jeff again as well, I'm sorry to you too, because I know you just got here. I hope you're doing well, Jeff. Um, <laughs> good to see you too, Derp. Um, I was gonna say, I'm gonna head uh, to the safe point. I feel like it would have taken a while. I didn't realize you had to get it like right on the freaking edge. Like that's just hurtful, you know? That hurts my feelings. Actually, you know what? Instead of calling it a stream now, I can check out a few more rooms on the right hand side. Just cause some people showed up. It's your birthday. Happy birthday, Jeff. You know what that means, Jeff? You know what that means? You get 50 fudge points. Would you look at you go. Moving around the world, yeah. Wait, what do you mean moving around the world? You shouldn't be moving anywhere. You shouldn't be moving anywhere. It's freaking quarantine time. You should be staying put. Wait, am I going the wrong way? Holy shoot, I am going the exact wrong way. What the fudge? You're moving to Australia, Caleb, are you actually? Can you wait till COVID's over so you don't get us all sick? That was lining. The better to stalk me? Yeah, nice try. You don't even know where I live. <laughs> Australia? Yeah. You know, Australia is a pretty big place. That's all I'm saying. You got nothing on me. You got nothing. You know nothing about where I am. One of the eastern states. Okay, so that leaves what? Qu uh, Queensland, New South Wales, Australian Capital Territory, Victoria, and sh if you want to try and like say I'm maybe on the eastern side, I could still technically be part of South Australia and Northern Territory too. So that's everywhere except Western Australia. As for Sydney, I'm not going to be that specific. I'm not going to tell you what fudging city I do or don't live in. Don't be ridiculous. You'll leave cookies on my doorstep? Oh, that's nice. You know what? I'll tell you where I live. <laughs> I'll tell you where I live for the cookies, you know? How do you know I'm not in South Australia? Because you're in South Australia? <laughs> now I know where you live. Look at that. Get played, Vic. <laughs> you got played. Um... Only one thing about the cookies, they're fudge cookies. That's cool, I like fudge. Fudge is delicious. I don't see the problem with this. Actually, you know what? I'm gonna save now before I check out those Eastern rooms. Played, no, bullied, yes. No, 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 there was no bullying here. I see this is an absolute win. No, I don't. I don't wanna be stalked, thank you. I can make my own cookies. It's called taking a walk to the nearest Coles and spending a few bucks. 
not sponsored by Coles. That would be fudging weird if I was. Imagine a fudging sponsorship from Coles. No thanks. What's a Coles? Fudging weirdo Americans not knowing your freaking amazing supermarket chains that you don't have over there. Can you eat it? I mean... Maybe? You can maybe eat a Coles. Wait, no, that way I had the, uh, the, the helmet door. I don't have the helmet door, I have the armor door. Can I eat it? No. I mean, isn't that everyone's default reaction? Isn't that the joke? Isn't that like how the whole thing works? If you don't know it, you eat it. It is a meme, yeah, there's a fudging... Well, I don't know if it's a meme, but, like, it's a, it's a common thing. Like, if you don't know something, you ask if you can eat it. I don't even... Is that the joke I don't know? Can I eat it? I got fudging played! God dang it, I'm the one getting played now. When the two have run each other through, the path to your destiny will open. Yeah, okay, that means nothing yet. This version? It's the remastered version, Jeff. I don't know what you mean by this version. Do you not like the original? Like, I'm, I'm a little confused. It's locked. An emblem of a helmet. Okay, that's a helmet door. He's committing this... What sin am I committing? What fudging sin? What fudging sin? You don't know. Nice. Nailed it. You nailed that so well. So well. Look, it's not my fault. Imagine playing Remastered that says I played Remastered Lara Croft and Assassin's Creed. I hate how the only Assassin's Creed game to get a proper remaster is Fudging 3. Where's my number one remaster? Huh? Like, I'm not hating on 3 at all. 3 is fantastic. But, like, come on! 1 deserves a remaster more than any other game in that series. It's so bad. It has not aged well at all. Anyway, let me... Oh, shoot. Oh, shoot. Oh shoot, I thought, I thought, I thought I killed the, I thought the dogs were on the outside. Fudger. Will I take the chemical to use on plants? Oh, <gasps> the chemical! Imagine thinking Ezio's the assassin of the first game. He's not. Huh? 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 Can you hear my confusion? I'm very confused. Oh, you can't combine two- Oh, I- Okay, right. I'm- I'm being dumb, of course. Now I need to go to a freaking locker. I gotta go run all the way back. Yeah, I, I, I don't... Yes, but... No one here said otherwise, Vic? And that's why I'm confused? You know what I mean? No one here said otherwise. No, you can't eat it. Fudging. Didn't even get to finish my sentence. Most people do it and it annoys me. It's because most people are dumb. <laughs> so many hydrates tonight. Thank you guys for- Oh, fudge. For keeping me healthy.
fudging knew you were going to come back to life too. Fudge face McFudge gee. Is there another one? Yeah. I don't like how the zombies keep coming back to life. Could they stop that? That would be lovely. Oh, I did not notice there was a sign on the wall there. I'm going to check that out. Special instructions for the disposal of dead bodies. We have new information regarding those beings that may appear to be dead, but in fact they're able to come back to life. There are ways to prevent them from becoming active again. There are two known methods. Incineration and destruction of the head. Oh, that's what the kerosene's for! Meanwhile, to those of you who still will live, oil has been placed on the first floor of the mansion. Take as much as you need and need something to light with, which you'll find by yourself. Oh my god, I finally understand. I finally understand now. I understand. Carson time? Fudge, yes. Will I take the incendiary shells? What? Incendiary shells? Actually, I need to pick up these other two things here. Like, why are they- how did they get here? First aid spray, yes. Can I carry two in the one slot, is my question. No, you cannot. Okay, so I'm going to keep these not on my person. But I am going to keep them, obviously. Okay. So I'm going to set those dudes outside on fire. They ain't coming back. If they on... F Where the fudge did they go? They're gone. I left you some bullets in the room on the right. Feel free to use them if you manage to get yourself in trouble. Barry! Barry! What a good guy. Um, yeah, I don't know where they went and that concerns me. Okay, well... I know what to do with the chemical to use on the plants. So real quick what I'm gonna do... Is... I'm gonna save the game and we're gonna use those chemicals. But in order to save, I need to use a freaking ink ribbon. Then we're going to go to the plants, we're going to use them on the plants, uh, and then probably call the stream then. I know I said I was going to call the stream like 10 minutes ago, but I know I'll just forget. You're going to sleep, she'll think, Kayla, thanks for stopping by, I appreciate you, I'll catch you later. And you too, Jeff, as well. Thanks for stopping by. Have yourself some good rest of your day, and I'll catch you later. Too tired to need sleep? Yeah, I need sleep too. It's freaking, like, what, 9.23? It's almost 9.30 for me. I'm very tired. It's about when I go to bed. Um, so it's on the second floor. Oh, it's literally right above me. That's perfect. Just don't tell the stream. Thank you, Vic. I appreciate you. But also, if you need to go to bed, go to bed. There's a god dang room there too. Okay, I'll check that next. This is... 
This isn't where I thought it was. It's not right above me, I'm thinking of somewhere else. Oh no! This isn't the room, see? I thought it was the room, it's not the room. I'm on the helmet. Okay, well, this is not the room. <laughs> Whoops. Um, well, I'll go to the room I unlocked, I guess. I guess. Like, I thought I wasn't in the right corridor when I noticed the, uh... There was no zombie there. You enjoying lychee candies? Ooh, I love lychees. I haven't had lychees in ages. Like, the, not the candies, but the actual... Ooh, that's creepy. I'm creeped out. I'm creeped out. The music is creepy. And I don't like it. I found him! Jill. Barry, I didn't mean to get you that excited. Right. Anyway, you Why, she's delicious. This. Research as well. The letters slipped inside the top part of the letters torn off. The rest is legible. Alma, I tried to survive only to see you again, but my efforts only delayed the inevitable. I'm infected and there is no cure for what will follow, except to end my life before I lose the only thing that separates me from them. My love for you. In an hour, I'll have entered my eternal sleep where there is peace. Please understand. Please know that I'm sorry. What? what do you make of it? Well, I guess we were right about this mansion being quite unnatural. We have a way with understatements. Where's the part that's torn off? Well, my only guess is that it was the most important part and somebody didn't want anyone to see it. Let's continue our investigation. Hmm. Water tank smells like something once lived there. Perhaps someone was using it to raise some kind of creature. Oh, that's not great. All various biological reports. Why would I just take a bug? A collection of insect specimens. There's a switch underneath. Press it. Yes. Nothing happens. Maybe it has something to do with the insect specimens. They need to be, like, rearranged. Interesting. So it fishing lures. Oh, that is... I know what I have to do here. Oh, God. Now I have, like, another thing to do before I end the stream. I'm not allowed to have too many things to do before I end the stream. Man. Hello? There's a large scratch in this wall. It doesn't look like the work of those rotting freaks. Oh, no. Oh, no. I don't like that. I don't like the sound of that. Is there something else here except zombies? Okay, so there's more ink stuff here. Another first aid kit, okay. So I'll have to return here next time I play. You know what? I don't know where the plants are all the way... Okay, the plants on the complete other side. What I'm going to do, guys, is I'm going to save that stuff for next stream. I have the plant I need to deal with. I have those things immediately to my upstairs that I need to deal with. Um, And then I have to continue the adventure. So I'm going to save that stuff for another stream. I say next stream. I don't know if it will be next stream or not. It depends. But I'll save it for another stream. Um... Because next stream I'm either going to play this or Left 4 Dead. I'm going to alternate between this and Left 4 Dead, I think. So. Let's... Swap the lighter and the fuel canteen around. Take the ink ribbon. I'll know I'll have this for next stream. And the ink ribbons I can put away. Uh, use ink ribbon, yeah, let's go. Uh, and we'll, we'll call it here. I'm gonna get some rest. I'm gonna put my control on charge because it probably needs to be charged. Let's be honest. It probably needs charging. <laughs> and we're gonna go find someone to raid. It has been uh, a great time. I've enjoyed playing. I hope you guys have as well. It's been an absolute blast and I am enjoying Resident Evil. <laughs> what? That's illegal, right? <laughs> no one's allowed to do that. It's, that's not okay. 
Who enjoys video games anyway? What's a ridiculous statement? Anyway, let's go find someone to raid. Uh, we, oh, we are absolutely raiding T-Nudes. If you guys don't know, T-Nudes is a, a good friend of mine. Um, she's playing Valorant. Go say hi to her because, yes, you know. Yeah, we're going to raid T-Nudes. Everyone, have yourselves a great uh, time zone. I'm going to catch you all later. Thank you all for stopping by. I hope you enjoyed the stream. And until next time, I'm a <laughs> yeet skeet skedaddle. Uh, and I'll see you all later. Goodbye, guys. Have fun. Don't die. I've forgotten my outro. Goodbye.